welcome to software demo again today my course content is on claim digger or schedule comparison in primavera p6 both are the same the term are different claim digging and the schedule comparison is different because change in the version so now schedule comparison is open in visualizer primavera p6 so i open in primavera p6 and i show you how to create a claim digger in primavera p6 or schedule comparison so here my my villa construction project is open so i have to comparison this schedule this line project assign base line first do not assign this one okay and then this line here none okay and go for maintain and restore you can see here this file is restored there is a b1 baseline and villa construction you can see this one both so i what i will do i will add an activity here we add an activity here in what after waterproofing add a activity a and then i will insert another activity activity b and then i will insert another activity here activity c and then i what i will do i will link this one by going to relationship to her we have linked these activities with it schedule it on 5 may so you see i have added activities here new activities a b c to just show you the difference in making a claim come claim digger or schedule comparison so go in tools here you can see schedule comparison it's same as claim digger so it will be open in visualizer i will show you both positions how to open the visualizer and uh, if you directly open visualizer you can also see schedule comparison there i will click i have click on schedule comparison here you, you can see primary paramavira p6 visualizer is open create or open schedule comparison if you open visualizer you can find here schedule comparison gantt chart gantt and time scaled logical logic diagram option so create new open new from existing or open from existing so you can open from a uh, new error from existing also i will create new comparison it's villa construction comparison comparison 5 5 2020 let go for option when i click on option there is a window open here in the front of you in this window here you can see you can also you have to assign a project which is revised here here is written revised project clearly and then you have to enter here revised project so i will go for jhu construction in the residential project here you can see villa construction this is my updated villa construction my updated and this b1 is my baseline so i will add this one this one and there i will go for project baseline uh, we can directly assign project baseline or we can assign project here if, if you uh, we click on baseline it will be directly assigned to baseline we will add a project here jhu same here construction and then i will go for residential 
will a construction be one here you can see add button come after when clicking on one this both original project or baseline and revised when i click there is an add button we will go for general here you can see we can create this file into a ca text file csv file and html file and this is output file source where it should be output group report by activities and this is one advance in this advance option you can show user defined fields units add deleted resource assignments i don't need resource assignment this one this one don't need percent complete don't don't need this information maybe no problem expenses i don't need expenses information constraints i don't need a constraint information code activity code assignment don't need this one notebook topics general activity information add delete general wbs information no need general project information i don't need and project budget so this of oh, this one i i selected some cost and durations and deselected some informations from this one and i will go for project and i have added here when i add this to both project we will go for top and we will save and draw here and we can save directly to the location we have assigned i have saved and draw so here you wait it's drawing so from the top actual labor cost comparison new actual labor old actual labor no difference new remaining labor and old remaining labor old remaining was 50000 and the new one is zero for these activities old actual expenses were this and new this one and remaining expenses this one you can see actual material material id cost remaining material cost here you can see the different dates start date and finish date this was old old late start date and this one is the new late start date you can also remove the dates here yes and we can also go for their schedule comparison here i show you schedule comparison here the users open from existing here yeah, this one existing option go there option we will go for advance here we don't need costs and dates we even draw here here you see total float comparison Here one sixty two float increased. In the second one, free float. Actual duration changes. Zero duration in old and new duration for these activities change duration. And you can see here unit percentage complete. This one is zero percent because it's baseline. And then this is baseline and this is the original. That's why this is changed. physical complete and duration percentage complete you can see all of these and you can see here at completion labor units and these were activity i have added activity a b c here you can see a b c here and these are predecessor and successor relationship i have assigned finish to start finish to start a b c and what proofing work i have added in front of you activity relationship added or deleted you can see here so this is my claim digger or schedule comparison i have drawn on primavera p6 visualizer you can draw on it and you can also create your here you can go journal csv file you can also save and draw here your csv file here and if we want to go there option journal and if i want to go there so 
we can open the file here file is opening here you can see the file generated schedule comparison completely as it is you can draw filters here you want to draw filters you can apply filters here you can filter everything here actual activity id and all that mm -hmm. This is my course content about Claim Digger, a schedule comparison in Visualizer and how to open and how to maintain this. This is my lecture about schedule comparison and Claim Digger, how to create Claim Digger, a schedule comparison in Primavera P6. So like, comment, share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest upcoming notifications. See you next video.